Okay, welcome. Frank Calabro Jr. here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you guys a real quick tip, and I'll show you how I organize my marketing by setting up these menu bars in the top of my computer right here. In order to make this display, um, let's see right here. How the heck do you do this? View. Let's click on view for a second. Um, toolbars. Yeah, right there. Uh, menu bar. Menu bar, bookmark tools. I think if you click on menu bar... Uh, Okay, the menu bar was the top one. The menu bar was the top one. And the, let me let me click, bring that back up. Okay, so it's going to be, you click on view up here, and then it would be the, um, come on, now my computer's like being really slow. View, toolbars, it's bookmark toolbar is what it's called, bookmark toolbar. So you're going to have to have this checked, Otherwise, it's not going to show. You see how it disappeared? Okay, so view. Hopefully, my computer's not acting crazy. On me. Yeah, see, it's acting crazy on me. My computer's being a little slow. All right, bookmark toolbar. i got to have that check for this to show. Now, what you can do is you just basically, you're going to uh, right-click in this area somewhere, and you can set up a new folder, okay? And you can name it whatever you want to name it, okay? You can name it, you know, whatever. I mean, you know, uh, you know, I'll just name it my folder for this example. My folder. Hit add. Okay, so that's how you put folders up here, okay? All right, but I'm not going to use that, so let's just delete it. Now, goodbye. Okay. What I'm going to do is this is a brand new landing page. I'm going to grab it and drag it and put it into one of my folders, okay? I've got all my landing pages, all my sales pages, everything. I'll show you here in a minute. I've got everything organized so I can just grab it really at the drop of a hat. I mean, just basically click a mouse. I can grab anything in any of my sales funnels, okay? And I've got all this stuff. All this stuff up here is strategically everything. There's a reason for everything right here, like websites. There's the websites that I go to all the time, okay? And I need to get to these websites quickly. There it is. It's all right there, okay? There's things that I that I need qu quickly. There's videos that I need fast. There's uh, stuff that I put in travel right here. Uh, traffic, right? These are my traffic resources, okay? It's all right there at my, at my fingertips. All my solo vendors. I mean, just basically everything right there. Uh, these are different tools I got in here. My my training pages, okay, I, with in my marketing, I swap out videos on these training pages. I send my list these training pages, but these are my pre-built training pages that I use for training my downline, for training my students, for training my business partners all across the globe. I've got pages already built, and I just swap out the videos and such, And but I use these all the time in my marketing, okay? I'm just showing you how I got this set up. My three-step formula, I'll show you this just in a minute. All my landing pages, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Um, I've got uh, two nines. I've, I've got two nines in this example, a 10, 11, and a 12. What do, the reason I got two nines is I'm using different domain names. You can see uh, galaxymillionaire.com. Click this instantly.info. It's the same. Uh, it's just a different uh, domain name, but same uh, landing page I'm using. And then I've got all my sales pages. Sales page one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I can instantly grab anything in this funnel. Every single thing that I have that promotes this funnel, it's right here at my fingertips, guys. Every single thing, okay? Do you see how easy this is? You know, if I need something, let's open up a new window. Let's go back to that example. If I need something, let's just say I need this right here, this landing page. Landing page one, I just click on it, guys. There it is, okay? It's right there, okay? If I need landing page two, there it is. Okay, it's a it's a different it's a different landing page, right? But whatever I need, it's right at my fingertips. Okay, if I need you know landing page seven, there it is. You know, I just click on it and there it is. Uh, if I need landing page eight for something, do you see what I'm getting at, guys? It's incredibly simple. Once you once you organize this stuff, there's my landing page eight. There it is. Okay, and there's nine. Okay, and it just keeps going. So you know, if you put this stuff up here on your on your menu bar. You can get to this stuff. It's, it's right at your fingertips. You can grab this stuff very fast. It takes you a second. Just click a mouse, and there's your landing pages, okay? They're all right there. So I'm just giving you guys a tip on how you can organize this mess, okay? So that way you can just put your stuff in order. Everything's right here. You can get to it really fast. And you can use this, this strategy for anything you're doing online. It doesn't really matter what it is. But I'm just showing you an example of my three-step formula funnel. And then I've got my power lead system right here, all my power lead system stuff that I'm using all the time. It's right here in this folder. There's all my traffic monsoon funnel. This is what I'm, I started this a video for. I'm actually going to drop in some more landing pages, okay? 
There's my traffic monsoon funnel. I've got six landing pages. I'm about to have 10 because we're going to put four more in here. And then I've got all my sales pages. Say I need sales page one for one of my emails. I want to insert this link in one of my emails. Well, there it is, guys. Okay. But then I just grab this link up here in the menu and I can insert this into one of my emails. There it is. It's right there. It's right at my fingertips, okay? And I do the same thing with everything. There's all my four corner stuff, all my landing pages, sales page one. All my four corner stuff is all right there, guys. It's all right there at my fingertips, okay? Every single thing possible is right there. So I'm just showing you guys a way that you can organize your stuff. But right now, let's work on this traffic monsoon, uh, this, this menu right here, because I want to drop in some more. So what I want to do is I want to grab this one right here. This is brand new. I just set this up. Okay, brand new domain name. I just grabbed it. And all I'm going to do is grab this thing. I'm going to drag it, and I'm going to put it in this folder. And I'm going to put it where I want to put it because this is landing page 7. Okay, and I'm going to rename it. So all I'm going to do is right-click. I'm going to click on Properties. Okay, and then I can name this whatever I want to name it. What I'm going to name it to keep it really simple Let's just see what I'm going to name this thing. I'm going to call it landing page seven traffic monsoon. I'm just going to abbreviate and then the website. I'm going to put the website address so I know what it is. I know what domain name I'm using here, what I'm looking at right here. Okay. And this one's called AmericanMoneyBoss.com. Now, instead of spelling that all out, I can just copy it. Let's just go ahead and copy that. Control C. Control Victor, okay, and then I'm going to save it. Okay, now, look at the menu now. You can see it's right here. Landing page 7, Traffic Monsoon, AmericanMoneyBoss.com. So if I need this landing page, there it is. I just click on it, okay? All right, let's grab another one. Here's another one. This is my landing page 8. So I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to grab the, the address. I'm going to drag it into the folder. Put it down right where it goes. I think I got that in the right spot. Let me click on that because I'm not even sure if I got it. Okay, that appears to be right. I'm going to rename it. Properties. Okay, I'm going to call this one landing page. It's landing page 8, and for my example, Traffic Monsoon, I'll just abbreviate it. And then we're going to grab the the domain name. We're going to grab that. See if I can grab that thing. I'm going to copy that. Control Victor. Save it. There it is. Now I've got it right here in this folder. Landing page save. What the heck is this one? Oh, I got that in there twice for some reason. All right, not a problem. Now, if you want to take something out of the folder, well, I'm going to take this out because I got it in here twice for some reason. Let's just delete it. All right, now I got another one. This is landing page nine. Grab this one. Drag it. put it where I want it. Let's go ahead, right click. We're going to hit properties. Okay, this is just a little tip might help you out might help you get more organized with your stuff so you can find your stuff fast. Once again, I had to figure this out myself after you know, I used to put my stuff on a text document and try and go find it. And I was like, man, this is ridiculous. This was it's, it was taking me way too long to find things. I forgot what the heck number I'm on. I'm on landing page seven, eight, was, I think this is nine. I believe this one is nine. Landing page nine. Traffic monsoon. And here's my domain name. I'm going to grab that right there. I'm going to copy that. Control C. Control Victor. And you can see this is going to save you a lot of time, guys. It's just going to save you a bunch of time. And there it is. And then I got one more page right here. Landing page 10. I'm actually going to advertise all four of these. I'm going to buy a solo ad for each one of these here in a few minutes. We're going to advertise these pages probably next week or the week after. I've got to look at my schedule. It's going to be landing to page 10. So this is going to be LP10. This is Traffic Monsoon. And then my domain name is right there. Control Copy. Control Victor. And there it is. So actually going to advertise these pages is one, two, three, going to advertise all four of these brand new landing pages. Now, 
you can see it's all right here now, guys. Now, anytime I want to get to one of these pages, there it is. I got landing pages. I got 10 landing pages. I use a different domain name for every landing page. You can see that, okay? Just to keep things simple, guys, if I'm, if I'm always mixing things up, it causes a lot of problems with my AWeber account. I don't want to get into all that because I got a separate list for every domain name. So I can tell where every single lead comes from in my AWeber account and also in my Power Lead system, but because I have the two platforms connected together. But this makes things very simple, guys. All my landing pages are right there. I can grab these things in a heartbeat. And then all my sales pages, you know, once they opt in and go to this landing page, they all go to the same sales page, one, and then there's two, three, four, and five. So you can also put your, uh, put your, you, you know, your, uh, your sales pages in here too, right? I put those below the landing pages. And then I've got, what is this? I put, I stuck something in there. My Traffic Monsoon Enroll page. Yeah, I just stuck that in there because sometimes I need this. Uh, from time to time. Oh, actually, this is a training page. Yeah, this is my Traffic Monsoon enrollment training page. This is for training purposes only. And, uh, you know, sometimes people say, hey, Frankie, can you give me some instructions on how to enroll? I just created this page, and that's why I stuck this in here. Okay, I, I actually forgot about that. But anyway, it, it's in there. So just put all your stuff in one folder for Traffic Monsoon. You know, for your Power Lead system, you can put stuff in one folder. Uh, for your Four Corners, if you guys are promoting this offer, you know, it's the same thing. I put everything in here in one folder. Just a little tip, little trick, just to help you guys get some things organized with your marketing. You know, if you're promoting 19 different things, good luck. I don't, I don't know what to tell you. I mean, <laughs> you're going to have folders going all the way across. You probably have two rows, but... uh. You know, I keep things very simple. I keep things uh, uh, streamlined, streamlined so that, you know, I can find things very quick. And, uh, you know, I'm too busy to do a lot of things. I'm making a, a, a ton of money, guys. And listen, you know, I don't do this for money anymore. Money's not even, it's, 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 I don't chase it. I mean, the money comes to me no matter what because I just push value out into the universe and I don't want to change the subject and go in a, a totally different direction, which I'm about to do. But, uh, you know, uh, here it is, guys. Here's a quick tip. Organize uh, your your menu bar up here. Drop your stuff in here so you can get to it very fast. And I'm going to highly recommend having each individual name per landing page to keep things very simple and you want to streamline your marketing. All right, that's going to be it for this training. Frank Calabro, Jr., signing off.